Hey guys, what is up? Joe with Chrome Unboxed here, and we recently put out a video introducing myself and Gabriel to the channel. We were right over there, we made some coffee and answered a couple questions, and in that video I said I use the Google Pixel Slate as my daily Chromebook, but then I use the 15 inch MacBook Pro to edit video. So as a traditional Mac user, I wanted to take a couple minutes and share some of my thoughts on Chrome OS and the Google Pixel Slate. But before we get into that, this video is brought to you by NordVPN. We recommend and use NordVPN because they keep your browsing secure on any device, whether you're using the Google Pixel Slate or the MacBook Pro. So if you'd like to learn more about NordVPN and their services, head over to chromeunbox.com forward slash NordVPN. So in general, my workflow is that I'm using the Google Pixel Slate whenever I'm working on social media or answering emails or any sort of online work really. And then I sit down at my MacBook Pro whenever I'm editing video or editing some photos or any sort of more graphically intensive project. So these two devices have a lot in common. They are both very well engineered and we could go back and forth all day on hardware, but the Google Pixel Slate and the MacBook Pro both have really high quality build materials and just look awesome. So when you open them up, both have excellent screens. The Pixel Slate has a 12 inch molecular display and the MacBook has a 15 inch retina display. So these are both branded displays, but they are both incredibly sharp and bright. Both of these devices are also USB-C only and they both have a fingerprint scanner. So that was a feature I'd really gotten used to on my MacBook. So I really like having that on the slate as well. Okay, so both of these devices have some similarities, but why is it that I grab the Google Pixel Slate whenever I'm heading to the coffee shop or doing some work around the house? First of all, the Slate is incredibly portable. I love being able to just grab this thing and throw it in a bag or carry it along with me wherever I'm going. And although the MacBook is incredibly thin and light, it's still a bit of a beast and it's just not as portable as the Slate. I love being able to just grab and go with the Pixel Slate, whether I'm using the Google keyboard or the Bridge keyboard or just grabbing it as a tablet. I also really like the versatility of the Slate. I love being able to just pop this thing off of the keyboard and use it as a tablet if I'm scrolling through Google News or watching some videos. And then whenever I wanna get some work done, I can attach it to the keyboard and get really productive, whether I'm using the Google keyboard or the bridge keyboard. Also, the physical volume buttons on the Slate are really useful, and I find myself using those whether I'm attached to a keyboard or if I'm just using it as a tablet. Lastly, the Pixel Slate and Chrome OS in general are just easy to use. I know that I can grab this thing and get right to work as soon as I open it up. It really is the quickest route to the web. It, it's the simplest way to get work done. I know this is a bit obscure and it's kind of hard to explain, but there's just something about opening up the slate and getting right to work. I like to be as efficient and as productive as possible and the slate allows me to do that. So guys, I hope you all liked this video. If you did, make sure to give us a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button down below and click the little bell to be notified whenever we put out more videos because there's a lot more coming soon. So that's it for this one. I'll see you guys next time.